So, for Chemistry 2011, um, for Ordinary Level, the main topics to watch out for in this year's paper are bonding, fuels and hydrocarbons, water, pH, acids and bases. They'd be my five main tips. After that, the metals option, rate of reaction, radioactivity, um, reactions by which I mean organic synthesis, chromatography, etc. Oxidation reduction. Now, the experiments, more importantly. The ones that haven't been asked yet are redox reactions of group 7 elements, relative atomic mass of a volatile liquid, recrystallization of benzoic acid, and to extract clove oil from cloves using steam. So they're the ones on the course that haven't come up yet for ordinary levels, so keep an eye on them. Um, after that, the most likely reoffending experiments that have been asked before are the heat reaction of sodium hydroxide with hydrochloric acid to prepare a sample of, of soap by the reflux method, to prepare ethanol and examine its properties, a titration using sodium hydroxide to standardize hydrochloric acid, um, to prepare ethine gas, that's the one with the Y in it, um, where are we? Oh yeah, prepare ethanoic acid and examine its properties. Produce oxygen from hydro hydrogen peroxide using a catalyst. Separate a mixture of colours using chromatography and prepare a standard solution of sodium carbonate. So, there we go. That's my tips for the ordinary level chemistry. Um, of course, you can get these documents. I have them uploaded to Mediafire and there's a link down below in the information section. For higher level. <clears throat> Your most likely topics to come up on the higher level paper this year are families of organic compounds, equilibrium, including Le Chatelier, whatever his name is, Le Chatelier's thing, uh, fuels and hy hydrocarbons, water, oxidation and reduction, the rate of reaction, bonding, gas laws, metals, the options, and trends in the periodic table. Uh, possibly also pH, reactions, gases. Now I know I'm listing out nearly everything on the bloody course, but keep in mind the way I have these arranged is we're going from the most likely topic to be asked in the paper down to the least likely topic. So they're in order of likelihood. And um, then same story with the experiments. These are also listed in order of the most likely to be asked down to the least likely to be asked. Um, we we'll start off with the four that have yet to be asked on the chemistry course since it started. A titration involving potassium permanganate and ammonium iron sulphide. The redox reactions of group 7 elements. Prepare a standard solution of sodium carbonate and a titration using sodium carbonate to standardise HCl acid. They haven't been asked yet. Um, now, the reoffending ones, the ones that should be back up again this year are Simple experiments to investigate Le Chatelier's principle. You probably know how to pronounce that name. I don't. Um, the concentration of chlorine in a swimming pool, relative atomic mass of a volatile liquid, to release oxygen from hydrogen peroxide with a catalyst, uh, to prepare ethanoic acid, to prepare ethene gas, that's the one with the E in it, not the Y. Um, measure the concentration of sodium... I'll uh, say that again. Measure the concentration of sodium hypochlorite in bleach. Recrystallization of benzoic acid, measure dissolved oxygen in a water sample, a titration involving iodide thiosulfate or something, what's that? A heat reaction of sodium hydroxide and hydrochloric acid, and perhaps to separate a mixture of colours using chromatography. Uh, they'd be some of the main experiments to expect on the honours chemistry. That be that. Take a look at me now, it's all over. I've been going out of my mind, running out of control It's been a long, lonely road, but I've walked it I have been sold you no good in a system that's wrong It's been putting us down and ruining lives It's so easy 